Arena. I am your Prima Play Announcer, Ben Packenbush, alongside my partner and color commentator, Ian Liddell. Yeah. Game might be started shortly, but first, that's what I am from. Coming up soon, the starting lineup. So we've got an interesting matchup tonight. We got two D1 talents playing on here. Got Anthony Thompson playing for Lebanon. And who do we have playing for Wynn Woods that's going to UC? Tyler McKinley. So it'll be interesting to see who will have a good chance to evaluate two of those guys tonight to see how they Good evening, everyone, and as a member of school, the OHSAA, Whitwoods High School welcomes you to tonight's contest between the Lebanon Warriors and your Winton Woods Warriors. To honor America, would everybody please rise as the Whitwood Band plays our national anthem. Respects the requirements set by the OHSAA and have been approved by both schools to provide their important role in tonight's basketball game. The officials for this game are Mr. David Morey, Mr. Mark Molinar, and Mr. Russell Merton. The athletes, coaches, and officials are guests of Winton Woods High School. All fans are asked to respect the effort each has put forth in preparing for tonight's game. We also ask all attending to show courtesy and respect for fellow fans, officials, coaches, those administrating the contest, and of course, your team, as well as the opponent. And as important today as ever, please respect the game. Now let's meet the players in a nice game, starting with the visiting Lebanon Warriors. Number five, a sophomore, Anthony Thompson. Number zero, a senior, Trey Hicks. Number two, a senior, Will Spittler. Number 22, a senior, Spence Davidson. And number 24, a senior, Quinton Wagers. The Warriors are coached by Mr. Nate Chivington, the Lebanon Warriors. And now for your Winton Woods Warriors. Number five, a sophomore, Nate Dawson. Number three, a junior, Siante Stewart Jr. Number 24, a junior, Imante Way. Number four, a senior, Sean Harmon Jr. And number zero, a 6'9 senior, Tyler McKinley. The Warriors are coached by Mr. Mike Pilgrim, the Winton Woods Warriors. Hey, 
And the about to be underway. Winter World entered this game 6-1. and one, And Lebanon entered this game 5-6. and six. Tyler McKinley will be taking the tip for Winton Woods. Um, UC, UC signing. And Lebanon's uh, Anthony Hudson will be taking tip. And it will be retake it again. Jump. Yeah. McKinney is on his way to UC. And Thompson's being looked at by Ohio State, Miami, Purdue. Three elite programs. They Dawson. <laughs> And miscommunication. Can you hear me now? Inbound will be taken in by Sean Harbin Jr. Here Given to number three, see on Thomas Stewart. Mishandled, okay. but Nate Dawson is recovered. Tyler McKinley. Nate Dawson for three, in and out. Will Spittler. Gives it to Spence Davidson. Anthony Hudson. Quinty Wagers. Doug Davidson. Nearly stole it away. Wagers for three, in and out. And Stewart Jr. grabbed the rebound. Lebanon's last outing, they played um, Turpin 62 to 60. Tight, tight game throughout. They showed Harmon Jr. with the ball. Hyler McKinley. Nate Dawson. McKinley. The, uh, the pass. What about the shot? Hey, Dawson. The reverse. Blocked. The follow up, but it couldn't handle it. Stolen by McKinley. Blocked by Thompson. Go try to go Here's to the hoop. first matchup. And up and out. Sean Harmon. Jalen Mercer, Stewart Jr. Cuts inside. Tyler McKinley for three and back iron. McKinley started 0 for 2. To the rim. Number zero and no good. Both teams Trey started Hickey out cold. Shot. Anthony Hudson. Side to Thompson draws the foul. And a double dribble. Uh, double dribble. Approaching. The 534 minute mark. It is still a 0 0. Both teams come out a little bit sloppy, a little bit trying to get into the flow of the game. Winter was coming off a win against Walter Hills on Tuesday night, but nearly does escape an upset by one with Walnut. Walnut winning the whole game, but Winter Woods does escape, going on a 5 0 run to end the game and winning as Leon Tona Stewart. Deontay Stewart gets the points, put the first two points of the game to the wood, and it was up 2 0. That's inside. Trey Hicks, Hudson, and bounces. Soft in. touch. And we're knotted up at two. Soft the touch from the big guy there. And we said earlier, Hudson's being looked at by two elite programs. Uh, Ohio State and Purdue. C. Stewart. Cut inside and rejected by Hudson. Actually, I'll make correct that he's being looked at by Ohio State, Thompson, Ohio State, Dayton, Indiana, Miami, Purdue, and West Virginia. Two elite programs. You got six teams looking at him. Cut inside and Nate Dawson is short. And they had two, but the cut back it, and the nice steal by finish. Stewart, and it's 4-2. You 
You know, he's six foot seven, but he looks like he's probably going to grow a couple more inches. And Will Spittler misses the three. Sean Harmon on a fast break, cuts inside, gives it to C. Stewart. McKinley to UC signing. Sean Harmon for three, and it's nothing but net. 7 2 with the Woods. And timeout. No substitution, my, sorry. No, just a substitution. Then Davidson comes up in half court. The spin and a foul. Got and a foul inbound, reach. no shot. Just a block, no shotting foul. So far, Wynn Woods is had, or Lebanon is having a tough time getting good shots. Sean Harmon gives us his first foul of the game. The inbound, nearly stolen, but Kyle Koch regains possession. Davidson misses the three. Off. Dawson, cut inside, C. Stewart. Dawson, cuts inside, the cut, and it's 9 2. Which is what to a hot dribble, start. Nice finish. And timeout by Winston Lebanon. I'm the other Warrior team. Wooden Woods start a little bit slow, but they've picked up the pace here in the last minute or two. And so far, Lebanon is having a tough time getting any kind of shots. The only basket they have so far is the soft shot from Thompson. It'll be interesting to see how these two guys, McKinney and Thompson, affect guys going to the lane. Because they both shot blocks. We are back from we the got a good out. house tonight on both sides. Looks like a good, uh, good away crowd from Lebanon. Full house here with um, Wynn Woods. Ben, do you know what Wynn Woods is ranked in the city? No, sir. Third? No, sir. No. They're not. I just know they're top of the conference. Davidson passes the ball. Super zero, Trey Hicks. Wiggers. Pass inside. Nearly got possession. Up. Anthony Davidson. Lebanon, up to a couple years ago, was playing in a conference more in the northern part, up in Dayton. Almost backward violation, but got the pass. Kyle Koch. Davidson. And turnover. <laughs> coach Mike Pilgrim in his first season, which was head coach as Coach Tate was coach last year. And Pilgrim Scott played some great basketball. 61 start the season. And 69 in conference play. Sean Harmon, Tyler McKinley. Good luck. And no foul, but the inbound for Walter Woods. Block, I couldn't tell by who. <laughs> couldn't see who knocked it off him. Was it the guard or was it Thompson? Anthony Thompson with the block. Inbound, Tyler McKinley. As he has options, but gives it to Sean Harrison, Sean Harmon. Harmon for two, and it's good. With it, it's also a great start that five here at the arena. Har that's five for Harmon. Got the three and the two. Yes, sir. 
He's been a Jets difference maker Thompson. so far. And turnover! <laughs> if you're with the Woods, this is the start you want. But offensively, and Levin and getting turn Levin turnover, and no pressure at all. And with, with game possession, once again, with, with Harmon coming up midcourt. And Dutch controlled by Dick Dawson. Tewsbury to cut by Dawson. And, wow. and has the last six points. Seven points for Winston Woods. He, he schooled them on that play. For three and in and out by, by That's Thompson. That's a tough matchup. Harmon for three. It's wow. good! He is lighting it up. What's he got? Ten? He's got ten points, doesn't he? Ten points for Harmon. That's a heck of a first quarter. For three for Wagers. And it's good! Oh, there's an answer. And they reply one of their own. <laughs> Davidson, excuse they me. They said, okay, you've outscored me 10 nothing. I need to get some points. Harmon. Dawson. For the last 30 seconds of the first quarter here at the arena. I was with high school. Evan Tewsbury. And in and out. Nearly turned over, but it turned over. Nate Dawson. Good. And the dunk. Oh, no, nope, no. Nope. Use the rim. It looks like he was looking dunk and then he readjusted and put it off the rim. And then turned it over right away by Lebanon after Monte Wea began to lead, which was lead to 13 off the layup. Wynn Woods has come down strong here in the first quarter. Started slow in the first minute or two, but picked it up after that. Sensational first quarter from the guard, point guard. McKinley gives it to Seonta to Stewart for three. Oh! Good! 13 points. At what the end of the first quarter, it is your Warriors 21. What a first quarter. And the Vinny Warriors 5. Who and this is what you want at the arena. He had 13 points in the first quarter. He said, to heck with McKinney, I'm going to show my stuff tonight. <laughs> 60 seconds. He might pull in a recruit himself. Maybe he'll go to UC with them. That was some impressive shooting. I think Indy. Lost went off. Somebody kick it out. Okay. People like step on him. You hear me? I don't know if somebody hit it. The monitor. The monitor's off. <laughs> gone. The monitor's gone, the mics are gone. We're spectators now. Levin and the second quarter. Levin takes the inbound. And the layup is good by Will Fittler. Jack Sack, Russell John Harmon. The layup is good by Monte Wea. Communication, but possession by Kyle Koch and makes a three. Kyle Koch with the three in the in the lead is trimmed down the We're 14. Hiram McKinley cut inside, comes back, gives it to 
and out, but that was shot by number 12. If it's me, Andy I'd Dewberry. give it to the hot hand. Let him. Sean Harmon. He's taking him one on one, and he's shooting lights out. The fadeaway. Oh. And, and misses. Cooled down a little bit on that shot. Will Spittler. Deals. Oh, school. By Dave Dalton. Very impressive. And oh! oh! Tried to throw to Hammer, oh. but was fouled. Oh. And will shoot two. I want to watch that replay again. He kind of bod he bodied him for sure. It's got to get back on his feet. I thought that was a hard hit to the floor. The first shot and the first shot to the night for the Warriors. First one is up and it's no good. If he'd have dunked that one, it would have brought the house down. It won't be the only time we see a dunk tonight. Well, you got Tyler McKinley on the court. And the second shot is up. And it's Devin Buttonette. Well, Coffee comes in. Woodwood has definitely come out strong, led by Sean Harmon Jr. Four. No, no. But sorry about that. I can't fight if he came off, but or other way. Levin has possession. Nearly left possession. Beth Davidson. Gives it to Wagers. Back to back to Davidson. So we'll have to see if um, Lebanon can adjust here or if um Thompson missed. And a, a and out of bounds. And out of bounds. Turned over. And we'll go to Lebanon with 552 left in the first half as Woodward leads 24 to 9. The spin, and it is out and out. Unlucky for Davidson. I see on his throw throws up to Tyler McKinley, oh, but it is going out of for the range. highlight reel on that one. That would have been a, a great highlight reel for both for both Harmon and McKinley. Passing is fouled. And Anthony Thompson will go to the line once again and try to put Levity at double digits on the scoreboard. We'll see if Levin can settle down here. Right now they're rattled. The first shot is up and good. At 24-10, Levin gets their, their, their points up to double digits and we'll shoot one more. And try to shoot the lead down to 13. Nice release on the three throws. Second one is up. And back Got iron and in. Stoppage of play. In substitution. Steve Stewart will give it to Nate Dawson. Five, five, less than five and a half minutes to go in the first half. The clock's oh. over. And short. Lebanon has possession. These guards have Lebanon going one way, and they're going the other way. They just cannot hang with them right now. Mel well, Crossy was short on that three. Had them, had them tucking me on their own half, but gets gets out. But stolen by Dawson, and would be a layup. It is in the See, miss layups, miss dunks. And Levin's on a 4-0 run, run. But still, which it was is in a good, uh, comfortable lead. But they need to score. They shift the momentum right back to the Warriors. As Mel Crossy gives it to Dave Dawson. Dawson with a three attempt. And it's nothing oh. but net. And the momentum is shifted back to which it would. That they go up 27-13. The four and a half left in the first half. They're knocking down shots.
Davidson. The cut inside to the paint. The reverse layup and it's fouled. It's a block and will shoot two. Not, not really a lot of contact, but. If you make both these shots, he will shoot. He will trim down the lead down to, to a dozen. Giving Sean Harmon a break, and somebody up steps in and knocks down threes also. The first one is good. Levin is perfect from the line so far. Well, I've seen so far, I can see how they're undefeated in the conference. Wooden Woods has come out strong. They does escape Water Hills, but a win is a win at this point. And, and they're getting closer. Uh, another win closer, hopefully tonight, for the conference title. And it's still very perfect from the line as the lead snap comes at 12 at 27-15. Lebanon back to 12. We'll see if Lebanon can. Lebanon's goal is to get it under 10 points by and, the end of the oh, half. And oh, with the layup, T. Stewart misses a wide open chance, a clear cut chance to make the lead 14. But you Lebanon know, has the a chance to make it layups has given Lebanon a chance to sneak back in. They could knock down a three digit. right here. And the lead cut down to Just like that, nine. we're back to nine. A moment ago, it was 27-9, wasn't it? Or 27-11, yeah. 24-9. Hiram McKinley, who's yet to score tonight. And a foul. Oh, call a hook. Number off. Got a hold. Almost and wondered if he was going to call a. In both, two, in both teams at two fouls. Three away, both teams three away from going to the, the bonus. With, le, with more than three and a half, three seconds more than a half, three and a half minutes away from being three and a half, from halftime. So the miss dunk and the miss layup has given Lebanon a chance to sneak back in this. Hunter McKinley puts inside, and he throws and the hammer down. And the fast break, and and Monty White and um, Jalen Mercer said, get that out of my face, not in my house. You know, he, he keeps going to the rim, but he's not really having a lot of luck. Here's the hammer down but by Tyler McKinley. you got to give him some credit for sticking with it. The fade away, and no good. Thompson's been McKinley off a little bit and tonight. And to Mercer, and the ball goes to C. Stewart. I mean, Chad Harmon. Nate Dawson cut inside and the layup on the backboard. And Wichita was on a 4-0 run. The throw. And miss it makes the layup. Didn't get back on defense that time. Sean Harmon. Boy, he's got a crossover dribble. He's Hiram McKinley. To Nate Dawson. Back to McKinley, to see Stewart, movement. the fadeaway, mid mid shot, and it's front iron, and nothing happening. As Lebanon on, on the other end, dunks like, it, and oh, misses! Oh, what was that? No excuse. A, that's on the line, but Woody Woods got away with a dunk there, but you can see it on sports that are not top 10 tonight. There was no reason he needed to go for a dunk on that. You're down 11, you just gotta put the ball in the basket. If he's trying to match dunk for dunk with Wynn Woods, I don't think he's gonna. If you just put it up, it's, it's a layup, and, you're, and it's, it's a nine point ball game it's once like again. He was gonna lay it up, and then he changed his mind. He was gonna dunk it. Where are you more and more about in the highlight reel to score a point? So he's now tied with Wynn Woods for missed dunks. Got a little bit of a bump there. Anthony Thompson, and in and out. He's off once on again. a shot. He's got a nice shot, he's at, just not making it. McKinley comes to the paint. McKinley to the rim. The layup. The fadeaway misses, and uh, nice follow. And, and Jalen Mercer can't believe the 13. Thompson went for the block, and the wood in the woods snuck on the backside and put it up. Kyle Koch misses. Mercer tipped it over to Stewart. Shot. They're just going Stewart right to the rim. Hoop and makes it in the. And the largest lead of the game is that Wichita Woods 16-point lead 
Time Leb out. Lebanon has uh, Lebanon. no answer for that dribble drive to the rim. That's pretty much there all night long. What? are back from the timeout with less than 90 seconds playing in the first half. That's what you would see, 35-20. So games this week, on Tuesday we had Kings beat Milford 86-65 in the Cincinnati Conference. Loveland over West Carmine 65-49. Lebanon 62-60 over Turpin we mentioned. Anderson 47-32 over Little Miami. And Woodwoods over Walnut Hills 49-44. Ben Stevenson, after we approach halftime with Woodwoods in, in in complete control up by 15. Avoids the block and banks it in. And Will Fittler gets another basket, the tally of points. So Lebanon's goal is to get this under 10 by halftime. Wooden Woods is to push it up to about 17 by halftime. Natron Harmon, T. Stewart. To the rim again. Inside. And oh, the travel. And travel. With 57 seconds to go in the half, it is 35-42 with the wood. Levin has this that Will Stittler inbound to 22. Ben Davidson, Nate Dawson comes in for number 12, Evan Sewsbury. Davidson. I don't Stittler, think so. Back to Davidson, cut inside. And he oh, scores nice again. There. Will Spitter with back to back buckets. Nate. Down to 11. You think Wynn was going to hold for one? I want to do that more. And it's steal. Oh, we got a steal. And it's and good. Like that, and it's really Down to nine. Levin is hanging around. But still, Wynn wasn't creating control. Lebanon is on a six run at the moment. Their goal was to get it under nine, and they did. Or right, that was my goal for them. And C. Stewart tipped away. The three, a weather beater, oh. and it's short. And at halftime, it is your Warriors, which was Warriors 35, and the Billy Lebanon Warriors 26. We'll be back in 10 minutes. I am back packing bunch with my partner, Dee Liddell. We'll see you soon. If you're Wooden Woods, you're wondering, how the heck are we only up nine? And if you're Lebanon, you're like it's static, it's only nine. A little bit at the end of the half, a little bit of sloppy ball control there, got him back in. Make for a good second half. This is what matters. This is beyond X's and O's. This is the difference mutual respect makes. This is what character looks like. This is what defines us in Ohio. This is sportsmanship. School sports, it's not the outcome that matters most, but the way the games are played. This message presented by the Ohio High School Athletic Association and the Ohio Interscholastic Athletic Administrators Association. And we are back for the second half here at the arena, which was high school. And 35 26 which was in front. 30 seconds will be back underway for the second half. And see you then. Lebanon will have possession. When the Woods will have possession, sorry. Nate Dawson will take the inbound. Sorry, C. Stewart will take the inbound. And we'll get the ball to Nate Dawson. 
in the third quarter with Bethune and we'll get underway. Nate Dunn to the half court. Dawson, the screen by McKinley, the three by Dawson, and in and out. They cut back inside to 24, and that was Wagers and Winton Woods regained some possession. So we'll see what happens here in the first couple of minutes. Does Lebanon get right back into the game? They're only down nine, or does Woodwoods extend it? See Stewart inbounds to Harmon. We'll give it to Dawson. Jalen Mercer. I think they need to get Sean Harmon re-engaged. See Stewart, the fadeaway, the, the glass quarter. in and out. Jalen Mercer. And back wow. iron, and Lebanon. Cooled off a little bit. With the starting this quarter, 0 for 4 for the field. If you're Lebanon, you need to get Anthony Tom Anthony Thompson in the game, get some points for him. He was fairly quiet in the first half. Infinity Thompson, the cut inside, and it's good. It's yeah, like that, on cue. And that's like, a, that's, and that's like that, it's a seven point ball game. What do you want to get, get, get hot soon enough before Lebanon gives in a run and get and either get, get tied there just in front? It was 24 to 9 at one point, or was it more 24 than 24 to 9, either? yes, sir. Nate Dawson, mid range jump shot, and, and C. Stewart grabs the rebound. And McKinley oh. off the backboard. Nice and finish. Wood is back in control as they score. Is that with the left hand? Ball given to Fence Davidson. <laughs> Terry Hicks hits back Iron and is rebounded by Winston Woods. Nate Dawson. Jalen Mercer. Sean Harmon. Nate Dawson. Green step by McKinley. Dawson gives it to Stewart. And a charge. A, a charge. Is it college or pro that got the invisible circle? If you had that, would he be inside of that? He was pretty I underneath the basket. On the replay, feet were set. Great call by the referees. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Davidson, Thompson, and, oh. ba and back iron is they good. They got Thompson involved now. And just like that, six, instead of a nine point ball game, it's six. If he gets going, that's a big thing for Lebanon. Now they're only down six. Nate He's Dalton, got a smooth shot. McKinley. He just wasn't making shots in the first half. Sean Harmon, the cut inside. Nate Dalton, the spin, and off the back, nice off the backboard, and it's 39-31 with the Woods. Big shot. You know, one difference I see from Mc, from um, McKinley versus Thompson is it looks like McKinley Thompson can play further out. And and Nevin replies off the off a layup. And then the gap four and a half missed, missed the going to third. 39-33 with the wood. Like McKinley's more of an interior player while Thompson looks like he can take his game out. Green set. And Harmon. Harmon. And it's good. That's what they needed. They had that big time in the first half. That's what, 15? Did he score in the second quarter? Oh, and off. And Off. lost control of possession, and Winter Woods gets a big important stop. And with a bucket here, either a two or a three, they're up by double digit once again. Kyle Koch comes in for Will Spittler. 
for Lebanon with 402 left to play in the third quarter. He's, he just looked like he took his eye off the ball there. Sean Harmon. Tyler McKinley. T. Stewart. Fought about the three. The ability inside. To separate. Nate Dalton. Harmon. Leave it out there. Oh, the oh. bank, but didn't get the shot. T. Stewart with the rebound. Oh, rejected. Nice Follow block. up and rejected. And a, a, a block. We see that in the replay. That was an impressive block by Thompson. It was. I thought it was goaltending, but. Oh. Yeah, good call by the referees. That was a nice block. He's got more involved in the offense this half, too. He's got what, five? The bounce pass to Sam Stoller. And given to Davidson. The cut. And given to number three, clean block. Good block. McKinney in regained possession. He gets it to Sean Harmon. Good kick. T. Stewart. Two shots. And good job taking it to the rim. That's what you want to do. And Woodward Wood has a chance to regain their 10 point lead with 3.11 to go. That's it, the third quarter. Both teams have two fouls. Number one, sorry. First one is up. The nice button net. Shot. If you get to the rim, you got to knock down your three. Wigan Wizards comes nice on stroke. for number one, Sam Stoller, a senior. They make it a double digit lead once again. The second shot is up. And we're, and nice we're back in front by double digits. 43 33. 310 left to play in the third quarter. Back to a 10 point lead. Trey Hicks. Hicks. Throws to the rim, the backboard, and misses McKinley with the rebound. Big stop for Winston Woods. I ball given to Harmon, and misses. Oh, it missed. Stolen by Stewart. Sloppy. McKinley. That's a mismatch. And it's good, and, and Winston Woods is up by a dozen with less than two and a half to play in the third quarter. A little sloppy there from Lebanon has now put themselves down 12 again. What do you fall? Limit got the lead down to six. They thought they could tie or get in front, but Woodward Wood said, no, sir, we're going to take full control once again. Quentin Wagers. Webinance made a couple of ill advised turnovers, which is what well, Norris has converted those into points. Davidson. Keeps trying to beat him on the inside. No space, but Wagers with the possession again. Back to Hicks. Hicks for, for two, nice and it's look, good. Nice looking stroke there. Thompson was looking for, asking for the ball inside, but he knocked it down. Stewart gave it to Harmon. Harmon coming up at court with, with 90 seconds left to play in the third quarter, which was up by 10. Harmon has worn out the guy he's guarding, guarding against him. McKinley to Stewart. The Dolls to Harmon. Harmon for three He's and back nice. Ireland and he in. He has a nice stroke. He's going to. Kyle Koch. Fade away and is in and he has out. He's got a nice touch, but it didn't stay down. Jalen Mercer with the oh, rebound. Going with McKinley the with nothing but space. Beautiful pass. And a 15 point Great lead pass. from the Woods. McKinley faces off the glass, and Levin is like frustrated, and they call timeout. That was a great pass from um, Harmon. Good recognition to see that he was open and put it right on the money. We got the last two scores for Winston Woods. The three by Harmon, then the dunk Broke by McKinley. by Harmon, then a for knocking him down all night, and then throws a beautiful down court pass to the big guy who finished.
I think tonight Harmon's probably been their most important player. Between the hot third quarter and now he's getting himself reestablished here in the third quarter. So you've seen him play this year. Has he had a game like this? Has he been consistent or is he on his game? Harmon. Harmon. I, I, I have met a game this year, but. Yeah. I'm not going to ask, but I don't know. He's been on tonight. He's got 18 points. And and, and we're back from the timeout. <laughs> Kyle College will take the inbound. We'll give it to Matthew Weber. Approaching the last 48 seconds of the third quarter. Matthew Weber. Thompson. Back iron and Jalen Mercer grabs the rebound. Stealing the right rebound off his own guy. See Stewart, Tony Hartman, who's been red hot tonight. Looking for space, but probably gonna hold for the final shot. Hartman. You watch his footwork. I mean, he's just schooling these guys. <laughs> the crossover, but not Well, mention. that time he got a little carried away. And we'll, and we'll, not get, we'll get a shot off, but it's already the expired, and we'll, and we'll have counted oh, anyway. Oh, I think, I actually think it had a chance of maybe going in, and Lebanon guy actually At the end of the third the quarter, drum. it is your World Series boys 50, and the visiting Lebanon Warriors 35. We'll be back in 60 seconds. We don't have to replay with the clock. Does he get the, even though it doesn't matter, does he get the shot off in time? The pass, so the shot would have counted. That would have counted. And watch him get a hand on it. It's like, him touching the ball was, was not real smart because the clock had expired. I don't, it wasn't going to roll in, but it never know. Feels like old man going to the fourth quarter. The band is pounding it out tonight. So to me, the difference in that quarter, just like the first quarter, was Harmon. Harmon is my player to the game tonight the so player, far. Yeah. He's the Skyline Chili player of the game. We don't have Skyline Chili, so I can't say that. <laughs> I, had, I had Skyline for lunch, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. We like Gold Star just as much. Gold right? Star, no. Yeah. <laughs> Matthew so Weber. What is your favorite chili, Ben? Is it Skyline? Skyline. Okay. Power cut and back iron. And Steve Stewart uh, gets the rebound. No look. But oh. Dana Mercer couldn't have full control. Got to catch it before he put it to the rim. He put it, right, he put it right in his mitts. Would have been a guaranteed possibly a basket, another basket for Winston Wood, but still seven and a half minutes to go. And Winston Wood looks like they are in complete control. And we're looking to win the game, but still, we got still got seven half. Anything can happen. Off the backboard and back iron, but it falls to Give him another Lebanon shot. and in and out. And McKinley gets the oh. rebound and a, a hard hit on, by Thompson. <laughs> Nate Dawson. Oh. And and off back iron and it's in and another best for Dawson and the lead is extended to 17. That more more than seven and a half to go. Kyle Koch. Wynn Woods has reestablished themselves after having a struggle with the end of the half. Self-inflicted, really. Quentin Wagers. Look for the foul, foul, but not and one. But number two for Lebanon, Willis Pittner will shoot two. With six, four, seven left to go in the regulation. As Quentin Woods leads 52-35. <laughs> Stewart 
if you're Win Woods, you just got to manage the rest of this game. Don't turn the ball over. And you can melt a and, and you can melt pretty good you, and, and spot you, right you now. You can melt as much clock as you want, but no shot clock. This is the first. No, triple sub for Lebanon. Second one is up. About to come up. Ben, unlike Lebanon. And yeah, make second. Hey, Ben, unlike Wooden Woods, Lebanon really hasn't had a go-to guy this game. No, they haven't. They've spread out the points a little bit. And it's blocked! Tron Harland rejected, who's had a great game tonight. Cut inside. Got past two players, but number 42, 45, Luke Edmonds said, you're not, not today. It's an interesting matchup. McKinley tips it over, but and but and lays it on a fast break and lays it up and just goes in. Trey Hicks with the Didn't basket. Use the backboard. T. Stewart, oh, and nice rejected, block. but falls to Dawson, and misses. But Dawson still has the firm possession of six minutes to go. And timeout is called by Coach Pilgrim. Oh, Woods. A full timeout. Thompson's had a couple of blocks tonight, maybe three or four blocks. He's only a sophomore, Thompson, but you can say he's still got some growing to do in his game. Not so much size, he's got the height. What were you saying when I was on my phone? What? Think up Lebanon at this point. Wood Woods is in control. 14 point lead late. Where's the record? If you're Wood Woods, you just got to manage the clock, get good shots, and you're pretty set. And we are back. What are you looking for? What's the record? What are you looking for? The record. Who's record? At the overall record. Wood Woods? The inbound is taken by Tyler McKinley. And a three by, oh, by a Harmon. No good, but Dawson gets the rebound. That almost brought down Ray in that one. And a offensive foul. Offensive foul on Winston Woods. Five and a half to go as Winston Woods leads by 14. We were blocked. I didn't see who the offensive foul was on. Was it three? Tyler McKinley called on the elbow. Uh, I didn't see a whole lot there. Five and a half left to play as a three ball, air ball. Air ball. And back on the follow up. Somehow he's got a couple shots inside. Well, Fittler cuts the lead down to 12. With less than five and a half left to play. McKinley, Stewart, I mean, Harmon, Stewart. Almost took a step there. McKinley. Dawson, McKinley, oh, thrown. Oh, he's out of bounds. And out of bounds, but back ball, step. he stayed in, now back to what it counted, but it's turned over, and left it with a three, can't turn the lead back to double digits once again, with 5-0-3 left to play in regulation. If you're Wooden Woods, you gotta make sure you don't do what you did in the first half and give them a couple of easy baskets here. And tipped away, but the ball hit with in with 4.55 left to play. 
There's been a couple times in this game when they've had a chance to finish Levin and off, and they've kind of let them hang around a little bit. Nearly stolen by Lebanon. This where you're Lebanon. Ben Stevenson. You've got to make shots. A three right now would be huge for Lebanon if they could get that. And it will cut the lead down to nine. They want to get it under double digits. Cut inside and oh, fouled. Got bailed out a little bit. There was no reason to foul him there. You know what I'm saying? He had no way he's making that shot. Just reached. Lebanon will have a chance. It's hot. They had the chance to okay, turn the lead on to ten. Watch this replay. Plus, at this point, you don't want to slow stop the clock and let them make free throws. The first shot is tough and it's good. Let the clock keep running. Back to 11. This to make it a 10 point ball game. The he first one is up and is out, and out. And he gets the rebound. And the race takes to 11. And Harmon has given the, has passed the ball. So if you're Stewart. in Woods, you're in no hurry this possession. You can let clock run off. Ball given to to Imati Way up. Forty seconds go off, no problem. Tyler McKinley. Dawson. Being patient, Mercer, smart. Stewart. Stewart for three. three. Take it. And it's good. good I got no problem with taking an open look like that. Stewart with another three tonight. With less than four That's minutes to play in back regulation. To Fourteen. That's a big basket. Could be a big shot here. And Weber short on that three. Oh, and McKinley rejects block. it. And with the, and Lebanon had possession. That was a D1 block right there. Yep, here's the block by McKinley. He got the second jump. That was impressive. Inbounded. Final about the three. But given to Fittler, given to Hicks. More than, less than three and a half seconds to go in the four, in regulation. Three and a half minutes. <laughs> and a foul on the floor. And he what? I think one that's more a good foul. call. He leaned him out. One more foul, and Levin will be in the bonus. Still a bo the bonus foul. for the rest of the game. <laughs> and stolen, and Winton was on the fast break. Harmon in the outer oh! room, and McKinley <laughs> throws the hammer. <laughs> Why not? That was impressive. <laughs> he was. Oh! 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 And nearly another layup. But here is the alley hoop <laughs> dunk. The, the coach look is like rubbing his eyes. <laughs> Here's the alley hoop no, dunk. Look. And the hammer was the thrown down off. by Tyler McKinley. Oh, and a three nice for Lebanon. Now it's back to 11. They two don't and a half, but right now, you really can time out by Winston Woods. It will be a 30 second time Coach out. Let's have a little conversation here. He goes, we're up 13. It wasn't a bad look. I think he's taking time out, sorry. I don't really have a problem with that. Got to catch this one. Here's the alley who dunks. They practiced this one a little bit. He knew it was coming. Throw it down. Little showtime right there. Why not? So you and I could probably do that dunk, but we'd have to use that little spring thing. Yeah, where you jump trampoline. up in the air, a little trampoline, yeah. Well, I'm not sure I could anymore, but. 
The, the fade away, no good. Yeah, well, at this point, two and a half to go in the game. But you're up 11. You just but can't you let them go on 11 or run. Foul. The All three. Right, the and no good, but rebound falls to Kyle, to Kyle Koch. Back to Koch. No fouls. And a foul, and Lebanon is in the double bonus for the rest of the uh, rest of the game. Me at that point, let him make that shot. If he's gonna make it, make it. It's kind of amazing. It's an 11 point game. No, there's only two minutes to go, but first shot is up, and it's good. With this free throw right here, Lebanon can make it a nine point game. With, with, less than, with, with two 13 left to play in regulation. And it's up and it's no good. Lane violation. Lane violation on Lebanon. Missed it anyway. So the lead team's down to, the lead team's up to 10 for Wizard Woods. So if you're waiting the Woods at this time, there's no reason to shoot the ball here. Just let the clock run. Sean Harmon comes out of the floor. Jalen Mercer. Just Nate Dawson gives it to C. Stewart. Jalen Mercer. Smart, smart. Sean Harmon, listen to the play. Tyler McKinley and fouled. I'm sure that's what the coach, when they went into the timeout, he was talking about it. So let's, let's manage the game. Pilgrim has done an amazing job in the first seven, in the first eight games for Woodson Woods. Only lot coming from the team in Cleveland, named Luther and East. Oh, gotta take it. Stolen away by Thompson. I like the rim, but here to make a single digits in a seven-point ball seven. game, and it's no good. And McKinley gets a rebound with 100 seconds to play. Steve Stewart, 90 seconds to play. Harmon for three, and it's in and out. That would have put the nail in the coffin if he had made that. And a three. And it's and we still got a game here as a three by number two. Will Spitter puts the game and it's a foul. So we have a seven point game with a minute left. We still got a game here. Amazingly. But Lemon will have to foul. Which means I think down there it was an open look, but he really didn't have to shoot. You have a 10 point lead, just take it back out and let the clock run. But Lebanon do have three fouls to get, but they have nothing to, but to do but the foul and let the intercept on the inbound. What you foul and then see if they can make three throws and then you trade three for and one or two for one. Inbound given to Harmon. And nearly fouled, but to swipe it, it, but he can't even get in the same area. Foul. Let, let, he let couldn't catch him. Foul him. There you go. And Dawson put the nail That's in the how you want it. Now if you're Lebanon, you need a three here. Two's not good enough. The two. No good. Rebound. And the miss fake miss. shot. And, that, and that, that will put that, the nail in the coffin for sure. <laughs> Lebanon still has two fouls to give. He's got bruises on both sides from, from those fouls. And that, that missed layup effectively ended the game. Yeah, that's the nail in the coffin. What it was will prove it 7 1, 7 0 in conference play. It's one of the more one sided nine point games and I've Lebanon seen. Lebanon will fall to 3 and 4 and 5 and 7 overall. Seemed like Wooden Woods had this game in control the whole way, but somehow Lebanon hung around to make a nine point game. So Wooden Woods will stay top of the conference, seven to one. Player of the game, Van is who? Player of the game is who? I'll give it to, I'll give it to. Harmon? Harmon, 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 Harmon. yeah. And yeah. both teams, are, and now Wooden Woods is a double bonus. Play of the game will be the attitude dunk. 
Probably the only time we'll go to the line. I tell you, though, Harmon in the first quarter, some of those drop back threes and. He was first shot. solid. And that is the dagger. He's probably got what? I'm curious to see what his stat line is tonight. Probably got 20 points, maybe. So, how many do you think McKin McKinley has tonight? 18, 20? Hard to tell. Probably the last season for Winter Woods because when we're stopping, they threw out the clock and we still need the foul. You know, Thompson, you definitely see some potential there. I mean, he's definitely got, he's got the range, the left shot blocking. The the last he's legit. Game. Over the back pass. He's gonna give it a little ball. Shot, and it's no good. Oh. And that will, and that's the over. It is the over. Rim, or are we gonna the final in the final dribble it dribble. out or yeah, dribble and it out. Six, final six seconds. And All right, Ben. Improves the seven to one. Entertaining seven game tonight. Play, and they are dancing in the arena tonight here at Woodland High School. Give credit to Lebanon for not quitting tonight, hanging in there. But Woods was, was clearly the stronger team. I am Ben Suckenbush. I think I'd give Charmin. Tomorrow, see you on our next podcast. I am Ben. Have a good night. Ian Liddell, see you later.